Expect a frosty night tonight here across central Indiana. Frost advisory in place for the entire viewing area. Kicks in at midnight, lasts all the way till 9 o'clock in the morning. So if you have sensitive seasonal late fall plants that you want to protect there, bring them indoors or cover them, uh, certainly tonight would be a good night to do so because, again, it looks like frost will be likely. Your evening forecast will see temperatures in the 40s and the winds will really lighten up. 47 to 7 o'clock, 43 at 9 o'clock, 41 degrees by 11 o'clock tonight, and those temperatures will continue to tumble after that. You can see numbers tomorrow morning in the city, 35 degrees, but some areas may even drop down to the freezing mark at 32 degrees. So again, very likely we're going to see frost, maybe even a light freeze in some locations as those temperatures get close to the freezing mark. Now looking ahead to Thursday, we're going to see a lot of sunshine. Milder temperatures will build back in because the winds are going to shift quickly to the southeast. So 37 degrees at 9 o'clock, but quickly up to 51 degrees at lunchtime. 62 expected by 4 o'clock in the afternoon. Again, about 10 to 15 mile per hour wind out of the southeast. The numbers for your Thursday ranging from 58 to 64 degrees, a little bit cooler in eastern Indiana's a little bit of cloud cover will continue to hang on. Now I want to jump ahead to Friday because that's going to be another transitional day. Strong cold front is going to come on through. It's going to slow down and stall out a little bit, pick up some moisture from the southwest, and that's going to lead to the development of rain showers, especially from Indianapolis eastward Friday afternoon into Friday evening. So Friday night football, depending on location, could be soggy and very chilly. And a very active eight day forecast in place here. That system that will produce rain showers Friday night will last until early Saturday morning, but I think for the Breeders' Crown Saturday evening, I think the weather should be okay there. 44 for high Saturday. Chance for a sprinkle of flurry is still not overly impressed with the moisture content of the system on Sunday. 43 for high. Scattered chilly rain showers on Monday. A struggle to get up to 50 degrees. And it looks like cooler air is going to settle back in for Halloween, so we can continue to kind of drop the high temperatures for now. We'll say 50 degrees for high on Halloween. Looks like 40s for trick or treating. Then Wednesday and Thursday, we'll see temperatures improve a little bit back into the middle 50s.